Hello and welcome to Empyreon Galactic Survival. This is version 1.10.8, we're playing vanilla, so no mods, no DLCs whatsoever. And I want to play all the storyline missions. Difficulty setting, let's check. I want to have the hard start equipment. Keep the toolbar items on death, this can stay normal, 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 this is okay. Enemy difficulty, you want to put this on easy. And this shall be fast. Fast constructor speed, fast blueprint and repair speed. Yes, this is all okay, okay. And we're starting on Akua. Let's go. Emergency situation detected. Robinson protocol UCH001A initiated. Do you want to activate the tutorial help information system? No, we will not play the tutorial. Thank you very much. Robinson protocol deactivated. Okay, let's pick up this stuff. Survival tool and the flashlight. And quickly check the inventory. Don't need these videos. I'm gonna use this one and the energy bar. Let's put down the tent first. Okay, and we start grabbing some resources. Plant proteins and plant fibers. It's a good source of experience. Some silicon. Some carbon. Level 2 reached. Okay, very good. This gives plant protein, the plant fiber. We we'll start crafting a few energy bars right ahead. And let's check the first milestone. We're gonna check the tech tree. First milestone is level 5, I believe, because I want to have the light armor. This will give us a jetpack and a helmet light. So level 5. Basically we're going around here the crash site and pick up all these resources. Mainly the plant protein and plant fibers. And a few of the base resources like iron, silicon, copper and carbon. Explorer token. Yes, we get a token for for each resource type that we discover. More stuff down here. Plant fibers, yes. These things are really easy experience. You get 100 experience points just for picking these up. And these ores only give 50 experience and it takes eight hits from the survival tool. Well, carbon only takes three hits. Let's also have some bandages. We keep the energy bars here in the in the in the survival constructor because they won't spoil there, yes? If you take them out they will spoil. <sighs> One of these as well. And I want to have level five and the and the light armor when the night comes down, which is in seven hours and forty minutes. So we can continue looting through the night when we have the helmet light. Oh, we have some copper here. Very good. New resource type discover copper. Oh. Didn't mean to go down there. <laughs> no. 
Level 4 reached, yes. Let's check the stats. Level 4, 500 something points, we need 5600. Okay, it'll take a while. I also want to see if we can have the constructor already, a MISC. Portable constructor, yes. Let's have one of these. Portable constructor. Ah, yes. Look at all these resources. Yes. Also need the plant fibers to craft fuel for our first chip. I want to skip the hover vessel and instead start with a small ship right away. And for that, I believe I believe we need level seven. We have a resource over there. Silicon, yes. Very good. Grain, yes, we have no use for grain yet. I believe we need a food processor to process it. But we get the experience for picking it up and it will regrow anyway. So why not? Oh, some copper. Wanna go back to the tent and place the constructor? We can start producing fuel and some ingots. Oh, copper. <laughs> this is, it's always the same with this game. Once I start looting, I cannot stop. Somehow I enjoyed it. I don't know why, because it's so rep repetitive. But it's it feels good. Level 5 reached, yes, very good. And we still have five and a half hours till the night comes down. Okay, let's go back to the recycler. Where is it? Over there. Not recycler, but the tent. You know what I'm... So, here it is. Dump in all the materials we have, silicon, iron and copper. Craft them ingots. Ah, keep the tokens here. Oh, let's keep it here. Okay, let's see, where can we find this suit here? Need to unlock it in the tech tree, of course. Weapons. So I also want to have an assault rifle and a shotgun. And the light armor. And maybe a motorbike. Where do we find the motorbike? Or hover bike? Down here. Hover bike construction kit. What does it require? Only a bit of carbon substrate. Okay. Let's do this as well. We continue looting some stuff. Oh, let me, let me quickly see what's next on the list. The next milestone is this Polaris Scout. This one here requires level 7. This is a really nice, a small, nice ship, ideal for the beginning. I like that. 
So we keep looting stuff until we're level 7. We are now level 5, need 7200 points for the next level. It will take a while. Take some wood as well. We also want to have a snack. And craft more of these. A few more. I believe one more should be good, yes. You feel very comfortable and satisfied. That means our health will go up slowly but surely. Okay, let's get back to the constructor. Maybe pick some wood on the way so we can start crafting the fuel. These take 11 hits, right? Yes. So, put the oars in. Our armor, we have the hover bike, very good. Let's have more of these. And then I want to start pumping out some biofuel. Or let's say... There we are, yes. Now we have our jetpack. And our helmet light. Very good. And where's the hover bike? Here. We don't need it yet, but... We will need it very soon, when we go for the deposits. Level 6 reached, yes, very good. One more level, how many points do we need for the next level? 8800. So that is 88 more plant fiber and plant protein, right? We're getting there, slowly but surely. Energy bar. Comfortable and satisfied, yes. Another resource down there. Let's have a look what it is. titanium here. Not that we need it, but we grab it anyway. Yes, new resource type discovered. Don't need any of this stuff yet. More titanium. Going back to the tent because I want to stay at the crash site. Oh, there's the obelisk. Yes. Very good. Another resource over there. Let's take a look. So 
silicon. Yes, we found silicon and iron so far. Right? And this should be copper. Copper, yes. Okay. That is good. Level 7 reached. Yes, very good. Have a few energy bars. Now we go back to the constructor or to the tent. Uh, let's use the bike to get back there. <laughs> what is this? Carbon, yes. Turn on the light. Oh, this thing is still doing its thing. Okay. Let's check the factory again. What do we need for the Polaris Scout? The following 16 devices needed to be unlocked in the tech tree. Landing gears, container extensions, wireless, fridge, RCS and stuff. Okay, let's go to the tech tree. I believe the wireless is here. The rest should all be small vessels. We need RCS, we need a detector. Thing has Gatling guns. Thing has an O2 station and an armor locker. It has a fridge. Container controller and extensions. I think it has thrusters M, I'm not sure. Rams, landing gears, spotlights. Okay, what else are we missing? Thrusters M, yes, container controller, ammo, fuel tank. Thrusters M, okay. Container controller for ammo and a bigger fuel tank. Where's the fuel tank here? Yes. Takes 13 and a half minutes. Add to factory. Iron, silicon, copper and a lot of carbon, okay. Let's see how far we get with all these resources. Carbon substrate 204, okay. We have enough. Exactly. <laughs> Iron ink, it's 58. We have 56, okay. Silicon 116. Need a few more. 158 copper. Okay, a little bit more iron and then copper and silicon is what we need. Don't need this. Don't need this. It's still working on the fuel. Okay. And the night comes down. Need some iron, silicon and copper. I would say, let's check the map. Where do we have the next deposits? We have one here. Let's go to this one. Gonna grab us some resources. Oh, and some iron. Maybe that's already enough. up a little bit I wanna don't want to dig down directly we're gonna use the drone for this
get no experience from these deposits. But of course it's easier to get resources this way. That's why I like to pick like to pick up the ore boulders outside because they give you experience at least. Okay, let's check how, how much do we have. 46, that will give us 92 ingots and we need 40, 50, so 57 or something. Okay, so this is already enough. Then we're going to the copper deposit next. It's over there. How much space do we have? Oh no, yeah, we have enough, okay. Get out them drone. It takes ages with the survival tool. I'm really looking forward to the drill. I believe we get an epic drill from one of the story missions pretty early on. And we can get an epic drill for seven explorer tokens from the Jin, from the Galactic Something Network. Okay, how much do we have? 96? Okay, that should be more than enough, right? Ah, we need more than almost 120. This will give us 180, 192, okay. Let's get back to the constructor, where is it? Over there. Copper and silicon. Let it craft all these and we're gonna get rid of the fuel. Okay, so we're done processing all the ingots and also have some fuel. We should have enough to get this ship going. Two more iron ingots. Then we need 67 silicon. 50. 62. Oh, that's enough. And we need 60 or like 100, 100 something copper. 14 more. Yes, very good. Start production. Will take 13 and a half minutes. Also, then we have something to eat. And now what I want to have, I also want to have a few weapons, right? I want to have the shotgun, with a few bullets, and I want to have the assault rifle, with a few bullets. And while it's doing its thing, we still have seven hours until the sun comes up. When it's done, it can continue doing fuel. We're going to sleep for eight hours. And there we are, everything's done. Want to have the shotgun here on the two and the assault rifle on the three. I like to keep my bullets down here. Oh, this stuff hasn't spoiled yet. Okay, nice. Okay, and let's spawn in the ship. Where is it? All the way on the top. 
gas. Give me all the fuel if we can. Then we hop in. Fill all. Doesn't work. 70%. Nice. Let's quickly check what it has. Group everything, okay. Equipment. Armor locker, detector, wireless, and we have a fridge. Very good. What I would like to have is have a switch for the fridge here. get everything? Yes, we can. Put the spoilable stuff into the fridge, so this and this will no longer spoil, that is good. And the rest goes into the container controller. We have 1500 volumes, so to say. Put everything in there. Then we grab the tent and the constructor. And then we will make our way to the base building site. Next episode we're going to build a base. And after that we're going to start with all the missions. But that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed it and let us see you in the next episode. Until then, have a nice day. Goodbye.